In going after your dream career, are you maximizing the downtime? Hi, I'm Nancy Soleri, founder of Living Full Out. It's interesting because as I lost my vision, I had a lot of downtime, believe it or not. A lot of times, you know, I don't drive, so I don't have to watch the roads. I'm in an Uber, I'm in a Lyft, I'm in a cab, whatever that may look like. And I like to take that as study time. I'm on podcasts, I'm on conference calls, you name it. Or sometimes I have to get up really early in the morning because I use special software on my computer that reads everything to me, and that's called JAWS. And I get up really early, and now I'm really used to it. I mean, we're talking 2.30 in the morning, 3 a.m., 3.30. Used to be back in the day, 5 o'clock, and now I'm, I'm way ahead of the curve. But it's interesting, having that time allows me to really not feel rushed. It allows me to develop my skills and do more research and practice. And that can be everything from, again, listening to a podcast to writing something. I don't have to feel like I'm up against the gun and I can write multiple drafts or rethink it or restructure it. If I'm having any tech issues or need to research a project or you know, study a spreadsheet or, again, maybe research that even a team member has given me, then I have ample time to do it. All of that time allows me to get my skills sharper. And I want that for you as well. Now, sometimes easier said than done, I realize. Now, I want to make sure that you check out in our description the video we have there for you because I understand sometimes it's hard to manage your time. Sometimes it's hard to know what are the skills I need to develop. And that video will help you a lot with kind of putting together some of the puzzle pieces. I also want to make sure that you, you know, ring that bell, subscribe to our page. And I want you to do that because I want you to be a student of life. And I want to be there right beside you every step of the way. And if I can give you a tip that I've learned and pay it forward, if I interview an inspirational guest and they've cracked the code on something, I don't want you to not have that. So make sure that you stay tuned for all the videos we put out. But most of all, take this time, this downtime to learn, to grow. Maybe you're looking for Mr. Wright or Mrs. Wright and they haven't come yet. You know what? Don't worry about it. Timing will happen when it happens, but take this time to work out, better yourself, get that rest, learn a new hobby, right? There's a lot of ways we can use our single time. Maybe you're in between jobs and right now you might be on unemployment, disability, or maybe you're just tossing your resume out there and you've got some savings and you're just waiting for the right fit. Well, you know what? While you're not working nine to five, while all the demands are not on your shoulders, you want to take this time to grow personally develop. That is truly what life is about. So get out there. Remember to always have fun. That is a large part of what it means to live full out. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you'd like to see other inspirational videos. Make sure to ring that bell. Also connect with us on other social media sites and comment back if you'd like to share what type of videos you want us to create. Here's to you living your life full out.